everyone, welcome back to my channel, Side Hustle Seattle. So as you can see from the title, I have officially moved out of the state of Washington. So it's a little bit of a surprise for me too, but long story short, I applied for this rotational program at work that's supposed to help you develop to a more senior leader, yada, yada, yada. I ended up getting it, um, which was a blessing. And they're like, okay, so your first rotation could be remote and like a special project, or you could have to temporarily relocate to another location where we have an office. And I was like, cool. And so they're like, all right, so your first rotation is a relocation one. You have a month to move. Uh, here you go. So <laughs> here I am. I'm officially in the mile high city of Denver. I've actually been to most states in the US. Colorado is not one of them. So I was taking a little bit of a gamble going to a place I've never been. Um, but I like it so far. It's hot, first of all. It's sunny. Um, I like the sun. I'm from LA originally, but after living in Seattle for six years and just like used to the overcast i'm like i need some sunglasses like my retina i'm definitely gonna get a nice tan while out here so looking forward to that if any of you live in denver or colorado and you have some suggestions about what i should do while i'm out here let me know i'm looking forward to exploring adventuring just trying all the different restaurants so please in the comments just leave like all the suggestions that you have uh, but with that being said what does that mean for of course you know, my notary business, this channel, my side hustles, etc. So let's just get into that. Okay, so let's just start with my notary business because one, that's what most of you watch my channel for, but then also that's probably what's gonna have the biggest shift um, as far as everything goes. So as you know, I'm commissioned in the state of Washington. Um, and because I am no longer in the state of Washington, I'm in Colorado right now, I won't be able to do notary work in the meantime. Um, but I did look into it and you can get co uh, commissioned in Colorado. It's actually fairly easy. So it's different in Washington in the sense that Colorado makes you take training courses, but they're online, they're free, and they're like 30 minutes. Um, and I looked into the application fee, it's like $10. So it's a rotational program, which means I won't be out here forever, but I'll be out here for a good enough amount of time that it would make sense for me to get commissioned again. Um, and luckily I don't need to like go back through, like I'm already in a certified that doesn't change because I changed my state. You know, I've already done all the basic like courses. I'll still need to of course understand exactly how to do notary work out here, but that's what the training courses are for. Um, so I've kind of already looked into that. I definitely have to do a, lo a little bit more work, um, and just like research it a tiny bit more. The good thing though, they do have Ron out here. So that's what I was scared of. So I was like, well, you know, Ron's kind of my thing. I don't want to necessarily do mobile here yet, um, but they do have Ron and Live Notary is a platform that's already approved by the state, which is great because as you know, I already have Live Notary. The unfortunate thing though, is because I have three platforms right now, right? Live Notary, OneNotary.us, Notarize. Notarize and OneNotary.us are not available in Colorado yet. Um, so it sucks because I'll have to pretty much get rid of three of those platforms. And stick with live notary which is fine i like live notary um but it does suck that like i don't have those available the good thing though is uh, i feel like it's kind of like inspiring me to do a little bit more research to see what other like different platforms and things are out there uh to see if there's any like other ones or maybe even better ones for colorado so i'm gonna do a little bit more research don't be surprised if you see like another video talking about new platforms i haven't talked through in the past because I'm gonna be digging around a little bit. So we have to, of course, talk my channel. So the title of my channel is Side Hustle Seattle, right? And I'm no longer in Seattle. Is the name changing? No, I'm just gonna keep it Side Hustle Seattle no matter where I move to, uh, because that's what it is. So don't expect that to change. I may do something like a little cheeky with the intro to like make a little bit more of a Denver theme. Who knows? I'm not that creative, but in my mind, it's gonna work out quite nice. So stay tuned for that for sure. Um, as far as like making videos, via Ron stuff, side hustle stuff, etc., those will continue. I think the good thing is most of the Ron videos I put out are just like general information. They actually have nothing to do with me actually doing the work itself. Uh, so those won't stop. I'll still be able to push out that content. Um, I'm actually excited to kind of get recommissioned only because I can go through the process of like one, of course, what it's like getting commissioned in Colorado um, from both the Ron and a general notary public standpoint, but then also what it's like to have two commissions um, and how that process looked and switching on my information. So I'm excited to share that with you. Um, definitely excited to do some more side hustle videos. I actually have some pretty good ideas, uh, some things that I wanna try. And I think one of the bigger unlocks is that 
I do plan to get a car out here because although I live in Denver, um, because I wanted to kind of be in like the mix of things, um, my office is not in Denver. And so I commute via public transit, which is fine, but I'm kind of over it. I don't feel like doing it out here. So I'm, I am going to get a car um, sometime in the next couple of months. And if you've watched my videos before, you know that's why I got in Toronto in the first place because I didn't have a car. And so having a car will unlock a whole bunch of stuff for me. For a notary standpoint, to a side hustle standpoint, to just a life standpoint, uh, I really wanted to try like mystery shopping and all these other different things that I really needed a car to do. Um, so stay tuned for one car reveal sometime in the future. And then also um, what different side hustles I do because I now have a vehicle or will have a vehicle, I should say. Um, but yeah, pretty much that's it. I just wanted to give you a quick life update. Um, excited to be out here. Again, if you are in this area, let me know, hook me up, leave in the comments what I should do because I am excited to explore this area. It's a very nice city, um, very nice state so far. So give me all the suggestions. Thank you so much for tuning in, for rocking with me, for continuing to watch my videos um, and hope you like my time at Denver as much as I do. So thank you for watching as always and I will catch you in the next video. Thank you.